What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Look what I got. Water shoes. And uh, pick these up because they're pretty cheap. But um, as you know, as you might go to a beach or something, uh, it might not always be um, silky smooth, uh, powdery sand. Uh, especially when you get into the water, you might have coral rocks the whole nine yards. Um, going to a uh, waterfall, you never know what's on the bottom. And so these are great because you can uh, wear these in the water, which unlike other shoes, which are way down, uh, feel really sloshy, uh, no gouda. But these are by Wave and they were really inexpensive. They're size 10 for me. And you can see here we have uh, a pretty thick sole, but the sole isn't as thick as you might think on this side. That, that's kind of heel support. But you can see here that it's probably half an inch thick all the way around and kind of a light foam, um, much softer than a regular running shoe. But we do have nice tread all the way on the bottom. And then on the top, it's just like a slipper. It's like a mesh moccasin, like uh, football jersey like material here I don't know if this is I don't think this is neoprene but um, a very similar fabric and then basically it just cinches around your foot and then you can draw it tight with this little um, plastic stopper right there and kind of make sure that this is not going to fall off but you know whether you're out and about and you need your foot to breathe that's gonna be fine or if you're gonna be in the water and you need your, your foot in the shoe to drain the water as well as dry out throughout the day that's gonna work so I think these will work kind of like a slipper moccasin you can actually wear these um, even without being in water but once you are this is what you're gonna want to stay comfortable throughout the day so I think they look pretty good stretch nylon uppers and they were pretty inexpensive i'll put a link to them in the description below check them out peter von panda out